You are strong, child. But I will break you. I'll never fall to the dark side. <coughs> you think torture will turn me, Malak? You are a fool. Torture? No, dear Bastula. You misunderstand. This is but a taste of the dark side to whet your appetite. When you finally swear loyalty to me, it will be willingly. Never. <laughs> Such resolve in your words, but I see the truth in your heart. The dark side calls to you, Bastula. You hunger to taste it. Become my apprentice, and all its power can be yours. Starforge. I've never seen anything like it. I'm transmitting these coordinates to Admiral Dodonna. Maybe a quick strike by the Republic can cripple the Sith fleet. Message is away. Now we can just wait for the Republic to show up. We should be safe here. We're outside their sensor range. Small vanguard of Sith fighters coming in hard. Someone needs to get on those gun turrets. Take those fighters out before they report our position to the main fleet. We've got problems. We've flown in some kind of disruptor field. All my instruments are jammed. We've got massive overloads in all systems. I'm picking up a single planet in this system. I'll try and put us down there. Hold on. This may be a rough landing. Talk about your rough landings, Karth. What's the matter? You're flying like you've been on an all-night Theresian Ale drinking binge. That disruptor field fried our stabilizers. We're lucky we made it down in one piece. But if I can't find the salvage to make repairs, I won't even be able to get the Ebonhawk airborne again. You know, during our rather rapid descent, I noticed the hulls of many crashed ships scattered across the landscape. Maybe the parts you need can be found among their wreckage. The old man's right. This planet's a technological graveyard. I saw dozens of downed ships out there. That disruptor field must have wiped them all out. 
Even if we get the stabilizers fixed, we have to find and disable the source of that disruptor field before we can take off. Otherwise, we'll just end up crashing again. They must have some kind of protection against it, but the Republic fleet won't. We have to find a way to disable that disruptor field, or the Sith will slaughter them. T3's picking up massive power fluctuations on the ship's sensors. They seem to be coming from some type of large stone structure to the east. It looks like some kind of ancient temple. Good idea. If that temple's generating power, it probably has something to do with that disruptor field. Hey, don't forget about Bastila, guys. We still have to rescue her, too. I just hope we're not too late. Bastila's been Malik's prisoner for a long time. If he turns her to the dark side, she'll join him and the Sith will become invincible. I remember, though I hoped you would not be so quick to embrace the being you once were. If Bastila feels as you do, then she is lost to us, Revan. Let us hope it does not come to that. Well, if Bastila's on the Starforge like you think, Jolie, then we can't rescue her until we disable that disruptor field. The sooner we investigate that temple to the east, the better. We can probably find the wreckage of a downed ship along the way. And if we're lucky, we can salvage some stabilizers from it to get off this planet. I hope everything works out as smooth as you make it sound, Karth. Well, so do I, Mission. So do I. Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. Let's go! 
ready. What? Wait a minute. You understood those creatures? Of course. You and Malak must have been here before. You, you probably learned their language back when you were Revan. No problem. Didn't work. Thank you. 
Quando com que puna cava tompa.
Tonga Upsha Umeno, Wanga Kun Biske, Bamulera, Chunyo, Takun Jostak Miki Gravel Mugu, Gachichu Ita Haldonga, Topa the Bong Walia Gando de Nago Chocho, Tonga Iwam Chiki Yuma Lipta at Inko Tu, Rondi Haldonga Kuhonga V, Wala Kun Bes. Tonga Upsha Umeno, Wanga Kun Biske, Bamulera. Gaba tompa culpa ye moca pada. Cachicho y tamo tonga. Tatum yo stack miki grabo moco. Tonga y wam chiki yuma linza ad inco tu. Tonga bucha un neno. Wanga. Gaba tompa culpa ye moca pada. Kipuna. Gaba tompa. Not this again! Got it.
Tengul. Kawabota. Donkey. Kawabota. Donkey. Kawabota. I want to talk about Kenki. Donkey. Bano. Kawabota. Donkey. Kawabota. Donkey. Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. Yes, what's on your mind? I don't really know much about You got it.
Yin Kim Kung no ba, mole na chico. Tonghe. Mana ma tota. Ako ji gratong bola, je shua kona tong. Chon King no pang pa, mole re kong kile. Kong kile no ba. Wata ti me, yop tu ne polo. Brana brata dom ke serja. Hachu a penke. Wait, you can't go in there alone. I had a premonition, a vision through the forest. There's great danger inside that temple. I can't let you face it alone. You might be walking into a trap. Maybe Malik himself is waiting inside. Even if he isn't, that temple will be crawling with dark Jedi. You'll need all the help you can get. <laughs> I don't know what he said, but it's the Republic fleet is on the way in. Not exactly the way I would have handled it, but given the circumstances, it'll do. Why do I get the feeling this is going to take a while? Still. Lord Malak, the preparations are nearly complete. Every day the Star Forge adds more ships to our fleet. It is operating at nearly 300% of our projections. The fleet is assembling around the Star Forge and awaits your instructions. Patience, Commander. My new apprentice is nearly ready. Once Bastula joins her battle meditation to our enormous fleet, we shall be invincible. Then we shall begin our final conquest of the Core Worlds, and the Republic will be crushed forever. As you wish, Lord Malak. No problem. Didn't work. I still got it.
Didn't work.
yin kin kung no ba mo le na chi kong to ha e tung kong chi ta kong jo stak ni ki gravel mo go ka chi chu i ta ta kong jo stak ni ki gravel mo go ka chi ta kong jo stak ni ki gravel mo go ka chi chu ka chi chu i ta ho tong ga yin kin tong ha e wa mi chi ki yo ma li ta a in ko tu Tutto da buon guardia gando de nave cho cho ta con jo stak mi ki gravel mo go ka chi chu i ta rondi ha donga ku hong ka vi wala ku me ta con tong ha wa mi chi ki yo ma li ta con jo stak mi ki gravel mo go ka chi chu i ta ha donga tong ha wa mi chi ki yo ma li ta ha in ko tu tutto da buon guardia gando de nave cho cho ka chi chu i ta ha donga You may let that dog just that Mickey grab the mogo. Kachicho ita ha donga. Don't hide what you did you may let that dog in go to. Si. Yin kin kun no ba. Ta kun. Ron di ha donga ku honga bi. Don't hide ta kun. Si. problem. Didn't work. <laughs> dares intrude on our meditations you know the penalty for <gasps> Revan you are back we have sworn allegiance to Malik he has led the Sith to conquest and victory your time is over Revan Malik told us what happened to you the Jedi Council has you are not fit to rule the Sith anymore Revan <laughs>
this. to enter the temple again, but he doesn't know you like I do. Not anymore. Not since you've changed. Come on, Bastila. We have to escape before Malak shows up. Escape? You don't understand. I have sworn allegiance to Lord Malak and the Sith. I am no longer a pawn of the Jedi Council. Surely you know what I mean, Raven. Look at what the Council did to you. They turned you into their puppet. The same thing they do to all who are truly strong in the Force. They speak of the dark side as if it is something to be feared, but in reality their only goal is to manipulate those who are strong in the Force. The fear of the dark side is a tool to maintain control. Why do you think the Jedi forbid you and Malak from joining the Mandalorian Wars? They knew you would realize your true potential and break free of their domination. Malak has shown me how the Jedi Council have been using me the same way they once tried to use you. They've been holding me back because they knew one day I would surpass them all. I resisted at first. I endured the Sith torments with the passionless serenity of a true Jedi, emptying my mind. But after a week of endless tortures, I finally saw the truth. Malak forced me to acknowledge my anger and pain. He showed me the liberating power of these emotions. Then he made me see how the Jedi Council has denied me what is mine by right. The Jedi Council gladly used my battle meditation in their wars, but they still treated me like a child, like an inferior. They were jealous of... They wanted me to bow and call them master and follow their code and obey their every order. But all the while, they were exploiting my battle meditation for their own use. You used to be Revan, master of the Sith. A pity the power you once had is so diluted in you. You could have been... With the power of the Starforge, Malak will destroy the Republic and conquer... You were stronger than I would have thought possible after what the Jedi Council did to you. Seems that Malik was wrong. The power of the dark side is not lost to you after all, Revan. Yes, Revan. 
I was there when you almost died in the trap set by the Jedi Council. I used the Force to preserve your life. We are forever linked by my actions on that bridge. The Council tried to exploit our bond. They hoped your memories would... You deserve to be the true master of the Sith, not... Your mind was too badly damaged to ever fully restore your memories, Revan. But your power... Once, long ago, you defied the Jedi Council, freeing yourself from their control. Listen to me. The dark side leads to death and destruction. I've seen the horrors the Sith have unleashed on the galaxy. Shut up, old man. Your time is over. The age of the Jedi and the Republic is no more. This is the age of Darth Revan and the Sith. Don't do this, kid. I don't want to. I'm a Jedi. I'll never bow down to the Sith. If you go- Kill him. Grind his old bones to dust. Show him the fate of all who did- Yes, the sacrificial blood- You will have to disable the energy shield around this temple before we can leave. You can also use it to disable the disruptor field. Yes? Sure. Vasily, you're alive. I was worried about you. For a minute there, I, I was sure that we'd never see you again once Malik got his... Wait, wait, wait a minute. Where's Jolie Bindo? Was he okay? W what happened inside that temple? What? W what are you talking about? The Jedi Council has failed, Karth. Darth Revan has been reborn. Together, we will destroy Malik and seize control of his fleet. Then use it to crush the Republic. Jolie would not swear loyalty to the new ruler of the Sith. He died for his foolishness. Now swear- Wait, what? No. We serve the Republic. You are no better than Malak. We'll never swear allegiance to one who serves the dark side. Wait, Lord Revan. Karth speaks only for himself. He does not speak for the others. He may find he stands alone here. The droids will continue to serve you, Revan. They are programmed to obey their master, and there may be others who will choose to join us. The Republic is doomed. Revan has returned. 
Who will now swear loyalty to the second coming of the Dark Lord? You're Revan, and I'll follow you anywhere. It doesn't matter who you're fighting against, I'll be at your side. Mandalorians don't have any great love for the Republic anyway. Light side, dark side, it doesn't make any difference to me, Revan. I'll stick by you no matter what comes. I saw what the Sith did to Terrace. Anyone who serves the dark... Mm. Sabar, Revan's a Sith, just like Malik. Mm. Mm. No, Sabar, I don't care. You don't have to help the Sith mission. Not while I'm here. I see now it was a mistake to let you go into that temple. And I, of all people, should have seen this coming. There was nothing you can say or do can make me... Run for admission! Go! Go! Let him go. We have more important things to worry about. We have to get to the Star Forge and... No! This isn't happening! It can't be happening! No, I'm not just gonna stand aside and do nothing! You'll... you'll just have to kill me! But I don't think you will. I don't believe you've gone over to the dark side. Not... <laughs> Looks like you'll have to do your own dirty work. <laughs> you do anything you don't want to. It's me, Big Z. Mission! Please, Zalbar, don't do this! Please! No! Well done, Lord Revan. You were as ruthless as Malik ever was. Quickly now, we have to get to the Star Forge and destroy the Usurper.
With each passing moment, your old apprentice becomes stronger, Master. We must act quickly to exact your vengeance. Malak will pay for stealing the mantle of the Dark Lord from you. Thank <laughs> you.